Good evening from Vazden, 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 I don't know. V A R Z I V A R Z D I N, Vazden. And uh, this is a town that uh, just until yesterday I had never heard of it before. But I went on Airbnb and I wanted to find a place that was relatively close to Zagreb where I'm going to be at tomorrow. And uh, this place came up. And you know, interestingly enough, as I started to look into it a little bit, it seems like it's a cool little town. I could be mistaken, but it might be the oldest town in, uh, in all of Croatia. I don't know, we'll find out. But anyway, so it's Friday night, and just after about five o'clock, and it's cold. It's, uh, <laughs> it's relatively cold here. Not relatively, it's freezing. It's, uh, it's damn near, uh, probably freezing and I'm just a stone's throw from the the old town in Zarden and I don't know if I'll have a chance to do a video tomorrow like a walk and talk so I'm on a mission to find a bite to eat and uh, I'm gonna bring you along I'm just gonna walk through the old town it's not even five minutes from where I'm staying so I will uh, try to turn the camera around here let's see if I can do that sure so I can turn the camera around and I'm just going to do a I'm just going to do a uh, a walk and talk if you will and bring you along through the the old town of, of Zarden and uh, apparently they have a uh, a beautiful castle here or a uh, I don't know if it's a castle or a or a uh, or a palace or a castle and a palace or or what have you you know this is just one of those little places that you stumble across in your travels and then you, you 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 either you know end up spending some time here or you bookmark it and uh you bookmark it to come back to come back later so right now i just want to find myself a bite to eat and uh i don't think that uh, i'm gonna have a whole heck of a lot of a lot of luck finding uh finding folks here that speak English it's just my uh just my intuition that uh I don't think that I'm going to have a whole heck of a lot of luck finding people that speak English but nonetheless we will uh we will see as the saying goes I think that the old town is actually just up this way so I see the sign that says center and I may very well do a, uh, I may very well do a video in the morning. This is only about an hour from, uh, from Zagreb, if that. It's, it's probably about 45 minutes from, from Zagreb. So I, uh, may come and do a video here in the morning as well. But right now, I'm on a mission. I'm on a mission to find something to eat. So let's go and, uh, See if we can't find some place, some place good. Here's a place that says, what, have a beer with a bear. Have a beer with a bear. I don't know what kind of place this would be, but uh, anyway, I'm going to poke around a little bit on Google Maps and find a place that, uh, find a place that I think will be uh, good. I'll look for some place that's got a lot of good star ratings and then, what I do is I look at the pictures on the uh, on the Google map. I'll look at the pictures and I'll see, you know, something on the pictures that I like. And then I just go in the restaurant and I say, I'll have me some of that. So let's, uh, I'll find a place and we'll be back. All right, so I think I, I think I found a spot just up, uh, just up ahead. And uh, boy, it's cold. It is cold. And I think it's a, uh, where is it? This might actually be, oh no, I don't think this is it. Oh look, they got the, looks like they got the Christmas market stuff going on. So, let's see if I can't, can't find this place. I think it's going to be up here somewhere. Let's see. Maybe it's down this, uh. Is it up this alley? 
there it is look at that it's up this little alley boy it's cold it's called restaurant Domin Dominique Dominique Dominic your destination is on the right there you go Restor restaurant Dom Dominico Dominico restaurant Dominico so I'm gonna go inside and get myself a bite to eat I hope so we will see Ooh. hello Ooh. do you speak English yes yes this is the best restaurant in all of the town yeah okay you don't know all right I'm gonna do a video for YouTube it's good okay sounds good can I go and just sit any place all right thank you all right folks so we'll go down and grab ourselves a uh, a place to eat I am uh, I'm hungry so I think I'll sit uh, right here next to the next to the stove so looks pretty good they got pizza here let's see Ooh, looks like a nice little town maybe I will stick around a little bit uh, stick around a little bit tomorrow all right I don't know exactly what I ordered but uh, I told him to bring me something Croatian and I think that uh, I think that he's gonna do that it's a nice town this town is only about 40,000 people it's not a very big town but it's a very very historic town if you look it up on uh, if you look it up on uh, Wikipedia you'll uh, you'll see that it's a rather uh, rather historic town so I told them to bring me something uh, something traditional this is primarily I think it's a pizza place believe it or not but uh, but nonetheless I'm gonna grab a bite to eat and uh, you know I think I will uh, I think I'll retire early tonight and uh, get up and do some work and then before heading to uh, to Zagra for the big advent tomorrow I will uh, maybe take a tour of the town and, uh, and bring you along so anyway I'll wait for my uh, wait for my dinner so you're looking at dinner this is uh, I said give me something to something traditional and uh, there you have it it's like uh, it's like sausage or something and they, they serve it on this they serve it on this bread and you just kind of tear the bread and put some uh, put some onion and that looks like some uh, some paprika so you put some paprika on there and uh, and you just eat away so that's uh, good enough for me it costs 42 kuna which I think is about six or seven US dollars so I'm gonna dig in and have myself a little bit of a uh, little bit of traditional Croatian food I wish I would have known they asked them the name but it doesn't matter it's all good all right, I gotta tell you, you know what? What could be better than sitting in Bosden, having some uh, authentic, I don't know if you can see that or not, authentic uh, Croatian food, listening to Sonny and Cher saying, I love you, baby, you know? Does it get any better than this? I don't know. Mm. That's good. I don't know how they say Najon Finam in Croatia, but mm, Najon Finam. Very, very good. All right, so back into the night of Barsden, Old Town. You never know what you're going to come across when you're traveling. So, we will see. This, uh, this town is known for its, its, its Baroque, Baroque buildings. And uh, I guess there's some mineral, mineral baths not too, uh, not too far from here. Some hot springs, if you will, which you'll find quite a few through all of these uh, parts of Eastern Europe. So I'm just going to walk and talk 
and uh, as this is a town of 40,000 people I can't expect that there'll be all that much going on on a on a Friday night but nonetheless maybe I can share some of the some of the items with you such as this looks like to be a church right here Let's see if I can zoom up there you go give a shout out to Phil back in uh, what is it middle middle Michigan something like that boy what a nice night we had on your farm when we were there Phil I sure would like to uh, come back come back maybe this uh, come back maybe this summer and camp out a couple nights I think I lugged that firewood that you threw into my car for the better part of my summer travels interestingly enough so sure could use some of that firewood tonight kind of interesting walking to town at walking to town at nighttime old buildings with a with a lot of character there is supposed to be like a um like a witch tour or something here in uh Varsden my uh Airbnb host had left some information in the house about a uh about a witch tour that you can take through the through the town so tomorrow is the night tomorrow's the night that I've been waiting for tomorrow is the the opening night of the uh, of the market the advent they call it in uh, in Zagreb and it's been voted the best Christmas market in Europe so it's gonna be definitely something that'll be interesting to see I've seen pictures of pictures and videos of the market in Zagreb and they have these colored oh, colored bags if you will like paper bags or something that they put candles in or what have you and they kind of float them up into the float them up into the sky boy it is rather chilly here tonight folks I don't know just how much time I'm gonna spend walking around the the streets here maybe I'll come back and in, into the morning and do a little little walk and talk we can, when you can actually see the city a little bit a little bit better certainly looks like a nice little town and I was seeing some pictures of a of a palace that they have here and the inside was just magnificent as a matter of fact this could be this could be it here, although I'm not quite sure. Let's see if these folks actually step inside this church. They may. And if they do, huh, it seems to be open. So I'm going to go step inside and see. I don't know what the name of the name of the church is but let's just step inside and take a peek I think they might have a mass going on And they 
do. Actually had a had a service going on. What a seemingly quaint little town this is. I keep debating I got to do some I got to do some shopping because I'm going to be going through some rather rather cold parts of Europe in the coming uh coming couple weeks They have this building here Looks like they have this building here decorated for for Christmas you can see in the in the windows they have the the days of the year in the in the windows and I would imagine maybe they take those take those numbers out as uh, as they count down to count down to Christmas it's actually maybe a hotel or this might be a castle or palace or something Folks, it is cold, and I don't do cold well, so I'm going to start heading back to my uh, modest little accommodations, not too far from here. And in doing so, I'll wish you a, uh, wish you a nice evening. The building you can see. I'm sure this town looks a lot different during the during the daytime. That's for sure. Charming little town. We'll give this video the title uh, Barsden Friday Night Tour. Something along those lines. For those of you that have just started watching my videos, do a search for Tom Hall and type in the town Talon, T-A-L-L-I-N. Just do a search for Tom Hall and Talon and uh, you'll see one of those most magical old towns in the world up in Estonia just a really really special little place so I think I've just about brought myself back full circle to where I started and with that said I'm gonna wrap up the video and wish you a uh, wonderful evening from Varsden, Croatia. <laughs>